Here we're going to show you how to use the OneSite Solutions MQTT client. First, open the OSS Easy MQTT palette, and then we need to take the MQTT service and drag it onto the Niagara Services folder. Next, we need to add a broker, so we drag that onto the MQTT service. If we look at that, the next thing we need to do is set up the connection to the broker. So if we set up those parameters for our particular broker, we're using login over SSL to connect to our broker, but there are a number of different options depending on what your broker supports. Now that's set up, we connect to the broker by running the connect action on the broker component. And that's connected. So let's talk to the broker. First thing, let's subscribe to some data. If we take a subscriber component and drag it onto the broker, open that up. And then we obviously need to define the topic we want to actually subscribe to, which will define what data we receive. So we put in the topic and then we need to actually activate the subscription by going to the subscriber and using the subscribe action. Now we're subscribed, so whenever data is published to that topic, we will receive it here and it will appear in the message out box like this. In this example, uh, what's being published is JSON data, but uh, this client doesn't really care what the format of the data is. Um, it will just appear in this box. Next, we want to actually send some data to the broker. So if we take the publisher component and drag that onto the broker, again, we want to set up a topic. So we'll just set a test topic there um, and then just send some random data. As soon as we save that, it gets published because this is set up to publish whenever the message in property changes. That can be adjusted by changing the publish on change property to false. If we change that and then change the message, save that, and that doesn't get published until we go to the publisher and use the publish action. Now it's been published. And that's the basic usage of the OSS EasyMQTT client.